So today, I've come down to Artisan to find out what it takes to become a master cocktail maker, which is why I'm joined by Chris, who's going to take me through the basics. Chris, what's the first thing we're going to do? So, I'm going to teach you how to free pour. Okay. Yeah. So, we have to free pour at the beginning of every shift. Right. We have to pass a test, a legal test, um, otherwise we can't free pour. So, this is like a drink driving test Pretty much. for drinking. Right, yeah, exactly. So, so we have to be ready on shift, the manager has to come and check. Why? Right. Fit and ready for it. One, two. Pretty good. One, two, three, four. Bit quick. 29.8. Each cocktail will have different counts of juice and sugar and citrus. Okay. Like that. So the cocktail we'll be making is uh, the raspberry and thyme sour. Um, the liqueur and the main base spirit is chambord and vodka. Okay. But it's equal parts, so it's both three counts. Right. To three. Okay. Yeah. Let's learn to pour and count. And now we're going to take one of their new flagship cocktails made with all sorts of special ingredients, and they're going to train me to do it. And then I'm going to go live behind a bar on their busy Friday to see if I can be a cocktail waiter. So this is what strawberry, strawberry and, lime. and lime. Yeah. And so what do you do? You take so fruit. we'll take the take fruit, uh, add sugar to it. That's all we do. Leave it for a couple of days. That's and that becomes the sweet fruit this. syrup. Yeah. Exactly. Brilliant. Oh. One, two, three. Okay. One, two. Dice. Go straight with a half on strainer. Right. Just over the few dice. One of the most important things for a cocktail is the garnish. Okay. And the smell and essence that you get from the garnish and the sight of it makes the cocktail. Okay. And um, it adds to the experience of time. And some raspberries. Raspberry and thyme sour. One, two, three. <laughs> Turn it to ourselves so the glass is facing in us. Case and the, in case it flies off. And then it's just, is that so right? Extend this elbow, not down. So okay. then you can push the cup. Are you going to test that for me? I will, what, yeah. See what the verdict is. Perfect. Yeah, absolutely perfect. It's good. It's good yeah. training. It is. So it is. I may have to do a few more before we go out and get it live in front of real customers. No, that's but, fine. but you think I've got all the basics in place? Yeah. Sound. So it's already a busy Friday night down here at Artisan. It's one of their big nights. They do two cocktails for ten pounds, put on live music and DJ. So I'm going to get thrown in right at the deep end. Yay! and the cocktails seem to do pretty well but I guess it's down to the experts to tell me so Chris what do you think you did well I uh, will be getting you on the bar next week throwing cocktails around you know I'll and tell you that I need to be a bit more cocktail um, exactly yeah, yeah a bit more flair a bit more yeah, flair behind your back you know it's never been said before I needed more flair but I'll take that listen it's been a great night and I think I'm in the mood now let's see if I can go get some tips and serve a few more cocktails great yeah, yeah. cheers Chris thanks yeah, a lot no cheers buddy. enjoyed it good yeah. pretty good